Literally over the last year, we've kind of continually looked at nutrition as being a priority in terms of educating our student athletes. Um, this year we took a look at our internal resources such as Sodexo, um, which is our major food provider across campus, and really brought them in with our student athletes to try to evolve, I think, our, our education regarding nutrition as well as food prep. So behind us, um, this is the first time we've tried this, is we're actually taking our student athletes, specifically with hockey, through a full cooking course. Hold it like this, and then put the knife like through here, and then just, you know? Uh, just like, you know, things that'll last longer in your body or uh, you know take up more take up more room whether I learned that protein doesn't actually give you the energy it's more like just makes you full you know storing your muscles and you learn that maybe you gotta put fats more pre-game meals and you know some more carbs I probably didn't know 99% of the things I do now so you know shazi has been great with us and obviously this is just another thing that you know helps us do that oh <laughs> Just like I said to the boys today, they can practice hours and hours at a time. They have different sets um, of skills. However, nutrition is that one area where they can truly improve, and that's in their heads. What they eat, when they eat, that's something that can really uh, make a difference between them and another player. Yeah, I've like kind of, I've been a guy who hasn't been great at it in the past, and like this year I've. You know, dialed it in a little more, and I can notice the difference in the effects. You know, uh, you know what you put into your body obviously has an outcome. So I'm trying to focus on that a little more.